Lana, uh, revoke their access, all of them, now. Lana, what's going on? Where are you? Commander, I have need of you. Our former Emperor, Vishyad, he's... I don't care what they tell you. Assume they're lying and deal with them. He's here. Vishyad's presence. Here on Zyast. He's taking over this outpost, controlling soldiers and Sith, using them to murder anyone he can. Hold them off. I'm on my way. Good, thank you. I'm sending coordinates. We'll hold this bunker as long as we can, but you must hurry on. Lana? Can you read me? Lana? Zios. Lana? Are you there? I had foreseen your arrival, but I didn't believe it. I thought, after bearing witness to my rebirth on the Yavin Moon, why? Why would you stand in the face of certain death? And then I realized you're a simple one. Not terribly bright, but that's fine. I'm rather pleased you're here. You'll bear witness to a world's end if you survive long enough. I suppose I should be flattered. So you've arrived. Good. There's much to be done. Then let's get started. Easily said, but it's all gotten out of hand rather quickly. And as you can see, there are complications. The Jedi you fought belong to the Sixth Line. SIS commandos who follow their own addendum to the Jedi Code, hence the name. There is no contemplation. There is only duty. A great point of view, so long as they're working for you. Pardon the interruption. I sent a probe droid to look into that crash shuttle, Minister Benico. It's empty. Minister Benico? Yes, well, I was never a fan of titles. I'm afraid this one's going to stick. Commander, it's a distinct honor. This is Agent Rain Kovach. He's been something of a rising star in Sith intelligence here on Zyost. I'd like to hear more about these Jedi. Do we know what they were up to here? You can thank our friend Theron Shan for that. The Sixth Line arrived when Vichy had started making moves. It's not clear yet how Agent Shan knew to send them, but we do know he's responsible. As you've witnessed, Vichy is taking hold of an increasing number of soldiers and Sith. His goal continues to be the accumulation of power. Agent. The dark side is strong on Zyost. Using the outpost's resources, our former Emperor can massacre the defenseless to fuel him. The more powerful he becomes, the more people he can control. He will keep on killing until nothing's left. Yes, I'm on my way. I'm needed everywhere all at once. I've already lingered too long. Agent Kovach has a plan to help stem the bloodshed. I'll get right to it, Commander. The outpost armory is wide open right now. It's where the possessed have been getting their firepower. It needs to be placed on lockdown. Fine. We've stood around long enough. I'll go out ahead. Be your eyes and ears. Each time a pawn's killed, Vitiate gets a little bit stronger. Not as much as when they kill, but... Well, that's what Minister Benico says, anyway. So we have to stop them without killing them. Or we destroy Vitiate. 
Not that anyone seems to know how to do that. Agent? Company? Almost there. Master Soro. Sixth Line Commander. I like this one. Strong-willed. Not that it will save her. Or anyone on this world. Madmen like you can't be allowed to reign. You have to be stopped. I would wish you good luck. But there isn't enough of it. When this world turns to red, and you choke on torrents of blood, remember that this was your chance to flee. A chance I... gave! There is no... contemplation. There is only... duty. We're wasting time here. The armory's safe. You go ahead. I'll be close behind. I can confirm it. The defenses are down. Between those weapons and the armory, a lot of the killing power is out of their hands now. Should be able to start evacuation efforts as well. The fewer potential targets on Zyast, the better. Sith intelligence hard at work, I see. <laughs> Look who it is. You're a sight for sore eyes. Uh... Hi. You know this person? Theron Sean, S.I.S. Really? Well, if you came here to save your sixth line, you're too late. If you know what's going on here, Theron, then you know it has to stop. Let's work together. Sure. All we need to do is figure out how to knock out a guy no one can touch. So I take it you don't have any ideas. I do know we have to try something. That's about it. The way things are out there, I can't believe I even made it this far. As soon as I crash landed, the Emperor's puppet started coming for my shuttle, just like that. Maybe figured on some easy kills inside. They're the only thing I could think of. Rigged the ship to overload, fry everything in and around it. Tried to shield myself, but still scrambled half my implants. And that stopped the attack? They went down, yeah. Some of them got back up, but they seemed out of it. Not possessed. Dazed. Intrusion! Vitiate's pawns! I have a thought. Be ready for anything. That was a... a nightmare. What? Who... who are you people? What's going on here? Leave. Now. You won't get a second chance. So now we know. Shock them unconscious and the tie is severed. Well, for a while, at least. Hit enough of them hard enough and they'll be out for a good long while. Yeah, but how do we do that? I, I have some ideas. I need to consult the new Adasta Municipal Systems. You gonna need a hand with that? Some backup? No. I'll be in touch. Well, he seems confident. Is he any good? Lana vouches for him. Lana Benico, Minister of Sith Intelligence. <laughs> Who'd have thought it, right? When I met her on Manan, she was in over her head. Seemed to be. I should never have sent my team here. I made a bad situation worse, and now... And now I've got a priority holocaul. Great. You've been busy, Agent Sean. Chancellor? An off-the-books mission to Zyost. A secret team of Jedi that... I don't even know where to start with you about them. Everything's happened so fast, you don't realize... No, I do realize. I realize that you declined to inform me of a prime opportunity to cripple the Empire and face the Emperor and on. We're taking advantage of the chaos on Zyost, starting with New Adasta. I expect your cooperation. Wait, please, before you send the order... You don't seem to understand, Agent Sean. There's nothing to argue. 
Our ships are in orbit. The invasion's already begun. I tried to reach you to tell you this won't end well. The time for hand wringing ended when you shut down the Orbital Defense Command Center, Agent. With respect, you haven't seen what I have on the ground. The power the Emperor holds. I'm aware, Agent. Now, if you have a report on Sith Intelligence or the SIS, we can talk. But you will not tell me how to fight a war. Damn. This is bad. That is one way of putting it. I take it you heard all that. Or enough of it. You pretend to work for Lana. I'm assuming the same relationship with Theron. So that makes three masters? Do you even know which one you really work for anymore? If we don't put a stop to Vitiate, none of that matters. I know I've made things worse. More innocents are dying because of me, and that's... Please, let me help you. This isn't over. No. No, I wouldn't think so. Plan's over. Scrapped. Some giant thing tore through a junction. Caused an electrical surge. Dampeners are shot. And you expect me to take your word for it? What's your angle, Kovac? I want this nightmare to end. That's my angle. Agent report. It won't work, Minister. I failed. Yes, you did fail. And for the last time. What have you done? Agent Kovac was a valued asset. He was working for the Republic. He what? I caught him talking to Suresh. He admitted his guilt. No. No, how could I have been so blind? Lana, we still have a problem to solve. Yes, of course. And I may have found a solution. I doubt you'll like it. I'm listening. War has broken out across the globe. Our former Emperor, however, has limited his involvement to the area around New Adasta, near you. I don't think it's a coincidence. It's possible he isn't as strong as he's been letting on. It's possible he's worried about what you could do. That's because he knows I don't give up. Good. I need you to maintain that confidence for what's to come. You must get all of his pawns, every last soldier, Jedi and Sith, to stop their slaughter and chase you into the heart of New Adasta. You must make Vitiate want to kill you, now. You've made it, good. Time is short, so is reliable assistance. As Agent Kovac is no longer in the picture, I've taken the liberty of reaching out to someone I hope we can trust a little bit better. Are you in position? Yeah, but this setup isn't anything like what you described. So what you're saying is you can't figure it out? Don't get all... I'll figure it out. We're about to begin, so that would be nice. What exactly are we about to begin, Lana? You're going to make Fisher angry. So angry that he'll place all his attention on killing you. When the time comes, you'll lead him to an electrostatic weapon stored here in the heart of New Adasta. It's meant to be a last resort against major civil uprisings, but Theron's modifying it to be non-lethal. With the reduced charge, its radius of impact will diminish. Fine. Let's get started. Yes, let's. Interrupting. Yes? Thought you'd be interested. I found something. A large weapon here in the middle of everything. 
I'm going to use it to destroy you. A little on the nose, don't you think? We did want his attention. I have to go now. There's much to be done. Too much. I shouldn't have come here, truth be told. Be strong. Stay focused. You'll be fine. Thank you. We'll see if you're right. That's it. Got to suffer as big a non-lethal burst as we can manage. Should be enough to zap anyone in range into a nice, long, involuntary nap. Should be. Hard to come up with a one-size-fits-all solution. A lot of guesswork involved. Wish there was some way we could do a test run. They've got to be closing in. Then come on, we need to be shielded. should wait until they're good and close. I thought we'd never meet again. It's nice to be wrong. And despite all the awfulness on Yavin 4, it did have its moments. Okay, here comes the Puppet Brigade. Fingers crossed. This one was closest, took the biggest hit. He's still alive. We did it. Let's just hope we got all of them. We should call Lana now, see if she has a plan for what's next. I have a better idea. Master Suro. No. Watching you believe you had a chance. It's amused me. But now, this whole charade is pathetic. Now, how do you wish to die? In combat, or on your knees? Go away, little Sith. This has nothing to do with your friends. This is you and I. I hope you're not expecting an easy fight. Confident. To the end. I saw it. I saw everything. Every life. Every life he took. I took. It's all I can see anymore. I'm a monster. It's not true. You'll be okay. I'll take you to Tython. The Jedi will help you restore your mind and make you whole again. And then she'll be no good to us. We need to understand the connection Bish had established with this Jedi so we can stop it or exploit it. Yeah, and let me guess, the process is invasive. Hasn't she been through enough? We've bought ourselves some time, that's all. We can't risk the fate of the galaxy just to assuage your guilt. 
You want to take her brain apart, and you don't even know if you'll find anything. We have to try. He's never leaving. I'm going to hear him forever. The Jedi goes with Theron. You're joking. Tell me you're joking. You heard her. Come on. I'll get you shipped out of here as soon as I can. I suppose we can be grateful that we managed some manner of progress. You know, Vishad gave up on trying to take control of me some time ago. Perhaps he's not as powerful as we were led to believe. Still, he is more than formidable. We've only stopped him temporarily, and war still rages. We have much to do. Darth Ma, you wanted a word? I couldn't make that out. Could you repeat? I'm curious. Do you really believe you've accomplished anything here? What do you think you've stopped? I'm not going to let you kill every living thing, just so you can live forever. I have already cheated death. I have other plans now, as you will see. I have decided that life is more interesting with you in it. If you wish to keep railing against me, then so be it. Your interference changes nothing. When I am finished here, when every life on this world has been exhausted, I want you to be alive. To know that I succeeded. Goodbye. I take it you've heard about Zyost. I saw it for myself. It was a blur. We tried to evacuate as many as we could. Considering so much was out of control, I'd say we did all right. But Vitiate is stronger now. Sith intelligence is in complete disarray. It's all coming apart. It's a setback, to be sure, but this isn't over. Not even close. When Darth Arcus first asked for my counsel, I considered turning him down. I wanted understanding, not a place in the power structure. But that's where I am. I don't take the responsibility lightly. Whatever comes my way, I will deal with it. I've seen what you're capable of. I know you won't disappoint. Thank you, Commander. Especially after Zyos. Putting an end to Vichit's threat feels like an impossible task. I don't believe it truly is impossible. Even if it were, we have to try. Is that optimism? It would appear so. Imagine that. Well, the Republic are licking their wounds, same as us. But they aren't relenting. 
and they're hardly our only concern. I suppose I should go about looking after the security of the Sith Empire, unless there was anything else. May the Force ever serve you. And you.